In this video I'll show you how to create price labels using digital font very quick and easy in GIMP. In the first part I'm going to focus on creating this graphic and then in the second part I'll show you how you can fill the prices using GIMP and uh, of course later you can print them or you can use them for a website for example and also in the second part I'll show you how you can use the array filter in GIMP plugin to create this and then of course you can print it and fill the prices manually let's get started by creating a new file file new then I'm going to select one of the templates this A4 300 ppi and of course the size can be different you can select different width and height here but the important part is this X and Y resolution if you're going to print these labels you need this 300 ppi so you can get a good quality print next we just click OK I'm going to create a new layer using this option and then I'm going to change from pixels to centimeters uh, depending on which country you live in you might want to change that to inches for example I'm going to use centimeters and here I'm going to type 6 for the width and uh, 3 for the height click OK next I'm going to zoom in and uh, with the move tool I'm going to switch to move the active layer option and position this over here next go to the edit menu and fill with the foreground color which is black now with the text tool I'm going to click here and type 88.88 Control A to select the text then here for the size I'm going to type 300 pixels also going to change the color to white and I'm going to select a different font and I'm actually going to paste the name of the font here and if I click here you can see the position of the font in this drop down menu and now I'm going to grab the move tool and position this over here for now next I'm going to grab this shear tool click and I'm going to type in here for shear magnitude x60 click enter and then click shear and this will straighten the text then I'll go to the layers menu and choose how to crop layer next if you want to align these numbers in the middle of the black rectangle we can choose the alignment tool click on the rectangle then holding down the shift key click on this layer and then use these two options now you need to also have a currency sign or abbreviation some currencies don't have a sign just abbreviation this pretty much depends on uh, what country you live in for example let's add a dollar sign first I'll need to create a new layer and then I'm going to move this layer on top and then with the text tool again I'm going to click shift 4 for the dollar sign Control A to select the text change the color to white and for the size this time let's say 100 pixels and for the font I'm going to use this one then with the move tool you can position this and if you want it to be in front of the numbers we can select that layer click on it hold down the control key and move it to the right a little bit and then select the layer with the dollar sign and position it here and now we can right click on the text layer and choose merge down and this way we'll merge it to the layer that we previously created and now we have this sign on a new layer so that's it for this part of this tutorial and in the next one I'm going to show you how to fill the price labels using GIMP and also how to use the array filter in the GIMMIC plugin to create multiple price labels and then print them so next part will be uploaded with this video link is in the description probably when you're watching this and that's it for this one if it was useful I hope you subscribe visit my channel for more
and that's it for now. Bye.